Welcome to this Design Expert tutorial. Today I want to show you how to set up a screening design in Design Expert and to do this I brought a little example with me. We want to look at the production of a polymer and we want to do that by looking at four process factors. The acid concentration, the monomer concentration, the catalyst concentration and the temperature and the response variable is the failure rate which basically records the proportion of failed processes so the reactions where we don't get a high quality product. And to investigate the relationships between the factors and the response, we want to create a so-called 2 to the 4 minus 1 fractional factorial screening design. And to set up the design, we will open Design Expert and click on the tab New Design right in the middle. And Design Expert sends us straight to the screening designs, more precisely to the factorial designs. And as you can see, we had four process factors so we are in this column here and there are two designs possible here the two to the fourth full factorial design which requires 16 runs 16 individual experiments and the two to the four minus one fraction of factorial design which requires only eight runs so we don't have so much time so we only want to do eight eight experiments so we choose the 2 to the 4 minus 1 designs which is here marked yellow and it's marked yellow because every fractional factorial design comes with a certain risk and design expert warns us about those risks with these traffic light colors so the green designs are pretty safe the yellow designs somewhere in the middle and the red designs are pretty dangerous so if we click next design expert tells us what exactly the risks is for this design and the risk are the so-called confoundings or aliases which means that you only can estimate the sum of certain effects so as you can see the main effects are confounded with the three factor interactions which is for most cases pretty safe because you can assume that there are no three factor interactions what is more concerning is that the two factor interactions are confounded with one another so if we don't already know that certain two-factor interactions can't happen then we can't tell where those interactions are coming from is it the interaction a B or CD we can't tell in this example so if we click next we have to define the process factors which were the acid concentration in percent from 20 to 30 the monomer concentration also in percent from 30 to 50 the catalyst concentration from 1 to 2 percent and the temperature in degrees Celsius from 100 to 150 degrees and if we click on next we have to define the response which was the failure rate the proportion of failed processes and now we can give some more information about the process here but this is for the so-called power analysis which requires a whole another video so we will delete those numbers here and skip the power analysis for now so if we click on finish design expert sets up the design and as you can see we have eight runs and this the runs are randomized to get rid of systematic errors and now you can start experimenting and filling the response data. If you like this tutorial for the setup of a screening design and design expert then maybe leave a thumbs up and if you want to see more tutorials for design expert and other statistical software consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you for watching.